Hello everyone, welcome back. It's the final day here at the 2014 Battle of Malta and by the end of the night, we'll have a new champion. Five players made it to day three of this year's Battle of Malta, and it didn't take long to reach the final table. Eight different European countries were represented, and one by one the players fell until it was just Anton Katsaroff and Alan Brincat left battling it out for the huge first place prize and trophy. <laughs> On behalf of Poker Listings and all of our sponsors, I would like to congratulate you, Alan Brincat, on being our second place finisher here at the Battle of Malta. And now for our 2014 Battle of Malta champion, Anton Katsaroff. Congratulations. It's very happy. Antoine, can you please share with us how does it feel right now to know that you have won the biggest poker tournament in Maltese history? It feels great. <laughs> it's nice to have such a cool trophy, such a nice winning, and uh, to be the best. <laughs> it's so everything's so nice. I'm just I just love it. Thank you very much. Can you please share with us a little bit about your experience with poker um, and just how you've managed to find yourself in this spot now? Uh, I started playing uh, three years and a half, three years professionally. I'm, I started uh, with uh, poker strategy, now I'm their coach, view producer and uh, hand evaluator. They helped me a lot uh, to improve my game and uh, to be where I am now. So what does this kind of money mean to you and what kind of freedoms do you see yourself uh, that will come out of this? It's going to help me to play the highest NTTC NT Tango stakes and uh, be one of the best. Well, congratulations to you both and a great, great run. Thank you very much. I'm Maria Ho here at the Battle of Malta.